In some under the radar news, Sony is shutting down Pixelopolis. What developer is that? Well, they made Entwined, Concrete Genie. That's it. Yeah, we barely even got two games from this studio. And really, it was too early to tell if they were good or not. Entwined was a good little game. Emphasis on little. And personally, Concrete Genie was a miss for me. Even though I can see why some people would like its art aesthetics. But this team was formed back in 2014. They only put out two games in the span of eight years. They are a smaller team with my investigative skills of deduction, estimating that this 15 was correct in 2019, but it grew to 20 by November of 2021, if we go by this image. Unless I miscounted, which is possible. So it was a very small team. To put it in perspective, a team like Naughty Dog that made The Last of Boar Part 2 had a team of about 500 developers. However, about 2,169 developers had a hand in making the game with lots of outside studio help. So we can see how 20 developers is a drop in the bucket and why it would be difficult to crank games out. And while I understand that creativity and all that is or was important to them, if you're not making games, how are you supposed to stay afloat? Well then again, we had a different studio make small and big games and really good games and was still shut down. So let's throw logic out the window. I just feel apathetic to this news and it sucks because it seemed like this was a studio that was trying to break away from the norm. But Sony is really focusing on their big games, you know, the third person cinematic game. As someone that never got The Last of Us hype, I was bored of this genre before it became the norm and now I don't even look forward to PlayStation exclusives. I followed Sony heavily when they were making lots of different games in a variety of genres while also being either big or small. It felt like they had every single type of game on their consoles. Compared to now, it's just cinematic third-person game. So it kind of makes it hard to care. 